Hello, my name is Natalia Fenderkova Malay. I'm a staff physician at Cleveland Clinic, uh, where I have a privilege of serving as the director of the Fibromusculodysplasia Clinic. It is a great privilege to be with our patients today and have an opportunity to present on renal fibromusculodysplasia, how it is managed, and when it is the time to intervene. Working in fibromusculodysplasia clinic for over 10 years, I know how motivated our patients are. They always come with great questions um, and they are seeking information. Uh, so it is our uh, commitment to serve the patients, to provide as much information as possible to help them uh, make informative decision, decisions about their health. I've been working in uh, um, fibromusculodysplasia clinic for over 10 years. Um, in Cleveland Clinic, uh, we, we see annually more than 1,400 patients that are coming with a diagnosis of fibromusculodysplasia. Not all of those patients are being diagnosed with fibromusculodysplasia, but a lot of efforts are made uh, and put to uh, making the accurate diagnosis for these patients. We have a dedicated group of five physicians who are primarily uh, seeing uh, fibromusculodysplasia, but our large vascular medicine group, virtually anyone can see um, this diagnosis and then refer the patients to us for more in-depth analysis. But it always uh, much more than physicians. We have a great team of uh, nurses, administrative assistants, vascular lab technologists, everyone working together to make the visits of our patients informative and to serve them well. We also work very closely with our colleagues in uh, interventional cardiology, interventional radiology, neurosurgery, um, headache clinic, nephrology, and other specialties uh, to make sure that all of the needs of our patients are well addressed. It is my privilege to be with you today and uh, have an opportunity to answer some of your questions.